so shampooed my hair now comes the fun part the part that i hate the blow dry which is why i go typically to the salon i don't know about you guys but i don't like doing my hair <laughs> i'm a black girl uh, with a head full of natural hair and um, i prefer it straight um, love the natural hair. Um, I've been natural my whole life except for a couple times in my 20s that um, I got a relaxer um, like twice a year because my hair was so big and so puffy I wanted to kind of control it and you know tame it but uh, no chemicals since then so I get a lot of questions about do you have a relaxer? Um, how's your hair get so silked out? And I always tell them no relaxer um, just all natural so and as you can see, as it's starting to swell, <laughs> ain't no lie on there. Here we go. I'm tired already. I need a break. I'll be right back. I'm still here. Now here's the crazy thing. You would think my hair was dry, right? Scalp is soaking wet. <laughs> oh my God. My hair holds so much moisture. Like, my scalp is, my scalp is still, still damp. Wrist, <laughs> cramp. <laughs> dryer, I'm gonna give it a break. This is a great dryer. This is um, Andy's. Um, it is on my Amazon storefront. And this is my trusty brush, wet or dry, that I use um, to do my hair, so. All right, let me get back at it. Storm! <laughs> That's what the kids told me. Storm. Yeah. Isn't that how they do it? That's how my stylists, they do it. They do such a good job. Caress and, uh, oh my God, Nina. Yeah, love you guys. This is definitely a ministry, not mine, but I'm so grateful it's yours. Um... Did not put any product in my hair, none. Um, shampooed it, conditioned it, rinsed out the conditioner, no oil, no cream, nothing. Because when I am wearing my hair in, um, you know, flat ironed or silk press, whatever you want to call it these days, it's basically just flat ironing your hair. Um, it just tends to um, do much better without any product because my hair, it has natural oils and the natural oils kick in rather quickly. So yeah, I don't really need a lot of product. So never been a product junkie because never needed a lot of product. There you go. They don't know what I'm doing. But I'm proud of myself because everybody that knows me knows that I hate to do my hair, but I love it to look good. So there. <laughs> and last but not least, 
products I use were Maison 276. This was the very first brand that reached out to me when I started my influencer uh, journey. They reached out to me, I was about six months, seven months into my transition and I rock with Maison 276, always have, always will. And it definitely has always kept my whites white. It'll keep your silver silver. It does what it needs to do. And it leaves your hair feeling amazing. There are um, three steps to the process. There's a um, cleanser um, that is step one that helps to take out any buildup. Um, I used all that up and threw the bottle away, so forgive me. But the next step is step two, where you hydrate. The Hydrate Shampoo, which is awesome, um, has sulfate, no sulfate, no parabens, DEA free and no purple dyes. So that's a plus for us gray hair, silver hair sisters. And then the restore conditioner, which is step number three. So today, this is all I needed. I didn't use step one because I didn't have the um, step one remove the buildup and I didn't really have a lot of buildup. So this is what you get. That's it folks, that's all I used. Okay, it's day two. Tied my hair up. I decided to do the two French braids on the dry hair. So let's see what we get. I'm headed to church, so praying that it turns out okay. Happy Sunday, by the way. And uh, I have on a turtleneck dress because it's 17 degrees. A, a sweater dress, 17 degrees, yep. All right, okay, all right. Nice, nice. I usually do a little flip over like that. few little flyaways that I want to tame but as you can see I've got the body that I love so I'm gonna use uh, my Manhattan Gray petroleum free vegan moisturizing pomade because it has a really nice uh, non-threatening um, organic spa like and it doesn't weigh my hair down so Put a little bit of that. Voila. Oh, praise the Lord. That's what I'm about to go do. So I'll catch in with you guys after church. 